So I need to put a block of wood in there. And the way I can lock my gate and nobody can surprise me while I'm out here grilling. Because that would be bad for them. So my gate is a little messed up, as you can tell. I'll show you. So you got a pretty far gap. So when this is like this, it doesn't quite meet up. So I need to put a block of wood in there. And that way I can lock my gate and nobody can surprise me while I'm out here grilling. So go over here to the spare wood pile and see what we got. I think this piece will work. So, I would love to own a Lowe's or a Home Depot. <laughs> That's how it goes. So it looks like I'm gonna double it up. That way it should fit perfect. So yeah, let's cut this thing. A plate for it so it'll fix that gap screw it back into here and I'm done easy fix I'd say that's a little bit of a problem ants I hate ants <laughs> All right, see how that works. Oh, just a little much. Oops, sorry, you can't see that. Just a little more. Just that piece right there. That's it. Boom. Sweet. We don't go in and out of this gate ever, so there's no reason this gate should be open, so. Boom, done. like the smoke of the fire uh, it's pretty cool pretty cool slow motion so just to explain what I was doing not really sure how it does it it just does it but it's cool to see the the flame actually ride the smoke to the wick so pretty fun don't do it without your parents all right so I'm gonna kind of walk the area to see about where I should put the cameras for this kid scare um, I was going to come out of the bushes, but since there's no leaves in this spot, I think he'd see me. He comes down this sidewalk, and I'm hoping he cuts through the yard, hopefully by this tree. Because uh, I'm thinking about putting a camera maybe in the tree or the mailbox. Um, so, we'll see. I'm probably going to hide right there. Since he comes from this way, I'll kind of blindside him and run out in the gorilla suit and hopefully scare the crap out of him.
and try not to get shot at the same time. <laughs> no. Um, my police officer friend across the street, he's not home, so I don't have to worry about that. He does come down the street, and then, and I'm running out at, a, at him with a gorilla suit. It's not going to look good. <laughs> but I'm hoping if I put a camera in here, he won't see it. I'm not sure not really sure about that yet so this is what we have to work with I'm gonna hide here camera there maybe camera there camera there and I might put one in their tree my neighbor's tree so we'll see hope it goes planned okay so I'm gonna camouflage my phone case since I scare the kids a lot they kind of look for stuff Especially Colton. So I got some leaves. Let me like tape them to here. That way it will cover my tripod. That will be hanging from the tree. It's another camera that will go by the mailbox. And some more leaves that kind of cover all this. So it won't look as obvious. The problem with scaring the kids all the time is you always have to think of a new way. And sometimes it's hard. Or you just got to think outside the box. So hopefully that teaches them to think outside the box. I don't know. Or it just teaches them to be scared of everything. <laughs> Either way. I don't know. All right. That should be able to hide it pretty good. I would say. Now for the tripod. All right. So here we go. I'm going to put this on. This over it. Of course the gloves. So, should be good. Random rabbit. Is possibly off. I hope so, but I doubt it. I think it'll be the next time we go around. You never know. You still never know. Never know, but I don't think so because he had never mentioned it. And you're probably not wearing your brace, your little bands. I am. Well, not right now because yeah. I took it off. Yeah. I gotta change and change them every now and then. Oh, yeah. supposed to. I don't do. <laughs> I do. Alright, so did I actually get you? Yes. A little bit. Did it kind of freak you out a little bit? Good job on doing the dishes. High five. Okay, so we're going to try the extreme pickle, hot pickle challenge, I guess, with Colton. Alright, so we're going with the best made extreme extreme hot uh i like best made because they're made in uh they're made in fort worth texas so i like texas so i support texas products it says violently hot flavor inside can cause extreme happiness <laughs> keep away from flavor challenge individuals as this may result in unwanted behavior so let's try it out don't get the juice on you here, here, here. Ready? Yeah. I'm gonna get two. 
Get to, oh yeah, do it big. Go big or go home. <laughs> How is it? Juicy? He likes hot stuff, so I'm not really sure. Good? You see? Yeah. See how bad these are. It's like a regular, like a, you know those pickles you get at the gas station? They're like in a bag. Ba I call them bag of pickles. Uh, it's kind of like the hot ones of those. Sorry, I'm spitting pickle out. But it's kind of like those, so not too shabby. They could be a little hotter. But they actually have a good flavor, so it's not too bad. It's probably because I'm hot because it was a thousand degrees inside Walmart when we were getting groceries. Now I want to try the juice or something. So, yeah. If you like them, try Best Made. They're good. They are good. The warranty on these guns is, like I said, it's a lifetime limited warranty. Obviously, if you don't have a, an authorized gunsmith take care of it, um, then obviously they're not going to cover it. Start, obviously I've polished mine, the bushing barrel and everything like that. Um, they're not going to cover this. I knew that from the get-go. And I just wanted to do it myself. The parts on these, any 1911, the, I mean, you can find them anywhere. Whose feet are those? Oh, oh. <laughs> Hey guys, thank y'all very much for watching. I appreciate it very much. Obviously, no animals were killed in this video. Uh, that was me in the costume. Hey, let me know in the comments who you're going for this, the big game tonight. Today's Sunday, so I don't know if I can say it. Can I? I don't know. Who are you going for the Super Bowl? Um, I used to live in Atlanta, so I'm going to go for Atlanta. So thank y'all very much. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're brand new. Thank you.